And this is the story of how we found our place at Tuscarora. Like, what are you thinking about? Um, well, I was looking at my schedule for, for like, this year. And then, uh, I've had some questions, so I wanted to see if you can help me out. Okay, and then how's everything else going? Right? It's going pretty good. I have some trouble fitting in, but other than that. Like with friend groups and things? Um, yeah, a little bit of everything. Okay. Now, and that's that's pretty normal, so I, I can definitely understand that. Well, maybe we can help you find a place. Oh, are they here from college? They are. These are some of my old students, some of my favorite. They're all my favorites, <laughs> yeah, all of them. So, but yeah, if you guys, um, would you want to hear what yeah. they have to say? Can, can I ask them a couple questions? Of course, of course you can. Well, like, as you probably heard, I've been having like trouble fitting in and everything, so maybe you guys can help me out a bit. Yeah, let's go somewhere else. Wait, so you don't like uh, so 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 well, I tried football freshman year, but I got injured at the tail end of the season. Uh, during uh, freshman year, though, I was an avid. Um, helped me get ready um, for high school and college through uh, study tactics, through organization, through tutorials. Can you identify your aha So my aha moment was and it pretty much got me ready for college and this is how I got into VCU. So what about you, Jeremy? So what about me? What'd you do in high school? Well... So, I used to be a part of this robotics club with some of my friends. But I was always screwing up. You've got... I'm Go. so done with you doing this to our project. That <laughs> One day afterwards, I was walking along and I found a golf club. And it gave me an idea. I remembered how I used to play golf when I was young, so I gave it a shot again and it turned out I was pretty good at it. Wow, I mean, I had a great experience with clubs. Leadership, however... It was my first year at Tuscarora, right, so and for some godforsaken reason, I thought it would be a good idea to run for class president. I had only been here a few months, and almost no one knew me. I'm kind of awkward and not a great conversationalist, so maybe I wasn't the best fit. I was under the delusion that I could actually do it until the results came in and I lost by a landslide. Can I do that again? Yeah. My name is Sydney Clark, I'm in 11th grade, and I'm running for class pre-, pre But everything worked out. One of my friends suggested trying Key Club. I meshed perfectly, and everyone wanted to help others and make a difference in the world, rather than being absorbed in their own interests. I ended up running the bake sale committee and raising a lot of money for charitable organizations. We are selling ice cream. We have cookie ice cream sandwiches for $2. Key Club can be a lot of fun if you look at volunteering as recreation instead of work. Fruit popsicles. Would anyone like anything? Ice cream, ice cream, ice cream. 
During my junior year, I joined a yearbook, and I thought it would be a great fit, but it wasn't right for me at all. I couldn't design spreads, and I couldn't think of good questions to ask people. It just wasn't a right fit. One day in yearbook, I was walking around school and saw the SEA classroom and picked up a copy for applications. I decided to apply for the secretary position and I got it. I really enjoy being on student council and all of the things we get to plan, like homecoming and pep rallies. I am glad I found my place at Tuscarora. Well, let me tell you my story. <laughs> I started my high school year without knowing anyone because I moved down to Virginia from Connecticut. I played piano for 10 years, but right before I try out for THS band and orchestra, I decided to quit piano. Yearbook was perfect for me, however, and they trusted me while I was a leader of the group and loved my design ideas. Now I love every moment of yearbook and I know that my experience in yearbook as co-editor-in-chief will support me forever. I'm kind of glad that I left. Sometimes I can hear the band director yelling from all the way on the stage. I mean, it's not that bad. You kind of get numb to it after a while. That sounds pretty bad. Why on earth would you stay? Well, I mean, the thing with track is... Okay, story time. So if you've ever looked at me, that's probably one thing that stands out. My height. Also my poor fashion, but whatever. I've never been a particular fan of sports, but I mean, it's track. With legs this long, how hard could running be? It turns out it's pretty dang hard. I had figured the track would be simple to compensate for my lack of athletic experience, and was very, very wrong. Then, while trying to find my way out of the school, I stumbled across something unexpected, and boy am I glad I found it. I met a lot of new friends, had some incredible experiences, and we even went to Hawaii. Hawaii! What about you, Eric? I mean, I wasn't really horrible at anything, but I didn't really find my place until senior year. I tried a lot of things. I tried to find a place where I fit in, and I was okay at a lot of things, but nothing clicked. It wasn't until my senior year in AP Lit that I felt like I truly belonged. If you take anything away from our stories, let it be that it is okay to fail. To find where you belong, you have to try new things, and you won't be successful at all of them. You're going to experience failure, but that just means that you're doing it right. Don't stress over finding your niche as a freshman. It takes some trial and error. Even if you're like me and you don't truly feel like you belong until you're a senior, everything will work out. Just look at me. Look at us. You're going to be just fine.